This is now a cruel world. It's of intention. He shall be charged for what? For being straightforward? For allowing all to understand the meaning of America, land of the free? Is this a medieval time, a time when being wrongly condemned is to be expected? My fellow Americans, we must not allow our nation to crawl into a hole. We must not allow evil to overtake us all. Let us show who's boss. My friends of all color, race, spirituality of all religions, let's use our power, the power we came to earth for, for good, for love, for peace, for truth. It's the God-given power, the power of the Almighty. And let us all pray that Donald Trump rises from this evil act upon him and makes a comeback stronger than ever. They may try to knock down and tear down this man, but one thing is for sure, President Donald Trump will show the American people the truth. My fellow Americans, barbaric actions against Trump will only prove that the evil ones are afraid of the truth being exposed and the greed and deceit will only show that the Democrat fools are guilty of lies, tricks, and corrupt abuse toward the only president who has the best interest of the American people in this country, the United States of America. He who resides with evil will be brought to his knees for redemption. And God should show all the truth that President Trump was the only man that was beaten down by lies. And now, my friends, he will prove to all that liberty will show itself once again with the hands, the knowledge, the love, the sweat and tears of each and every man and woman who is proud to be an American. We will prevail. We will not fail. For now, let us come together and allow the truth to finally open up the gates for this nation's glory. Our hope, our future, our children, our love for one another, and our greatest choices, our free will, our home, the land of the free. God bless America. And let's bring President Trump back to help once again the tree of life, the Statue of Liberty, God's glory. Much love to you.